Yes, a bombshell confession in court today from a substitute teacher at Mar Vista High School who had sex with a student. Martin Gallegos is now facing up to five years in prison for pleading guilty. 10 News reporter Vanessa Van Hefty joining us live from Imperial Beach. And Vanessa, you talked to a student who's actually transferring schools because she doesn't trust teachers at Mar Vista anymore. Yeah, that teacher today admitted to having sex with a student that he met here on campus. He also admitted to the judge that he sent naked selfies of himself and encouraged that student to do the same. Martin Gallegos pleaded guilty to felony statutory rape today, admitting he had sex with one of his 17-year-old students here at Mar Vista High in Imperial Beach. Have you pleaded guilty or not guilty? Guilty, Is that because you did have sexual intercourse with a 17-year-old minor who is not your spouse and who is three years younger than you? Yes, sir. The Sweetwater School District confirmed Gallegos was a substitute teacher and had been an ROTC instructor for a matter of weeks before his arrest last school year. The district reached out to students and families to investigate to see if there were more victims. The 48-year-old, one of three instructors and coaches arrested for alleged sex crimes against students. This student didn't want to show her face, but says she's transferring schools because of it. I feel insecure now, like, you know, and my parents actually told me that I should move schools because it's not, you know, safe anymore. She says there are still inappropriate things happening at the school. There's this one teacher that every time a student, like, walks around, he keeps looking at them and they're like girls. And, you know, it's kind of comfortable. She's friends with one teenage girl said to have been involved with the teacher. She's traumatized and struggling. She's all alone now. She's like, she doesn't talk to anybody anymore. She's embarrassed. We went to Gallegos' home looking for answers, but he didn't come to the door. He faces up to three years in prison. I called Manny Rubio. He is the spokesperson for Sweetwater School District. I asked him in light of these three cases if the school district was planning to make any changes, do anything differently to protect its students. He says because these cases are still pending, he can't comment, but we will continue to, to ask those questions until we get answers. Reporting live from Imperial Beach, Vanessa Van Hefty, 10 News. Vanessa, thank you. And as Vanessa just said, this is not the first case that the Sweetwater Union High School District has dealt with this year. In March, driver's ed teacher Alejandro Rodriguez arrested for sex with a student, allegedly. The following month, volunteer football coach Edward Mendoza was accused of the same thing. ROTC instructor Martin Gallegos, the man in Vanessa's story, he was arrested as well for a relationship with a student. Court cases for the other two men are still moving forward.